How's it going everyone and welcome to the Resident Evil 7 speedrun tutorial. So this one's hopefully going to help you out with a couple of the more difficult trophies or achievements we're going to be going for the just get me out of here which is complete the game within four hours. We did this game in about two hours and five minutes so we absolutely smashed that. It's very easy to be get that achievement and beat that time. Uh, also the resource manager which is completing the game without using the item box more than three times and the game scripts in three uses of the item box. So you literally can't use the item box until you absolutely have to until the game makes you pretty much. And and uh, the walk it off achievement as well which is complete the game using three med items or less i went through the whole thing without using any med items there were no deaths so hopefully it should help you out a little bit with that stuff but mainly it's that route this is also a new game run through which means there's no unlockable items just the stuff the game gives you as in your first time through so you could do this your first time through but also if you're going to get the speed run uh, i reckon and you're struggling with it i recommend uh going ahead and, and completing the game on normal first to get the stronger handgun and a couple of items that can help you but you don't have to do that it's not that difficult anyway but hopefully this helps some of you out let me know in that comment section if it did this run was taken from live stream so if you hear me talking with the chat hopefully you understand why also if you'd like to get this game cheap you can do so over on g2a links are in the descriptions for that cheers for watching guys and i hope you enjoy the run hey baby i just wanted to send a quick hello and i love you oh good news I'm going to be coming home soon. Yay! Fuck you, Mia. That's all we have to say. I cannot wait to be done with this babysitting job and come home to my loving husband. Full of shit. I miss you. Oh, I, I gotta get back to work. I love you, Ethan. I miss you so much. I'm sending tons of kisses. Bye, baby. The record actually changed to one hour 54 min. That was for um, New Game Plus, Jim, which means you can use unlockable items. The I think the record for New Game is like two hours 20 something, which we actually beat yesterday. You were right. But. I did lie to you. I shouldn't have. I wish I could skip this, but yeah. Um, All I can we might, is we might beat it, but also there's probably other people getting records and stuff. I just really want to kind of do something to put up on YouTube. Stay. Away. It's more of a tutorial for people that tells people the route and stuff like that and where to go and what you've got to grab and whatnot. And I know it pretty well, probably not perfectly, but that's what we're going to go for here. But I think the one hour 54 min is console New Game Plus, which we could actually smash if we used all of the uh, items. Hello? Hey, it's... I'm uh, pretty sure we could beat it. It's Ethan. Oh, hey. You alright? You just disappeared the other night. Yeah. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. It's Mia. She's not dead. She's alive. She, she's back. They found her? How? What happened? I don't know. Look, I, I don't know how, but she's back. She's back somehow. And maybe it's a prank, but she wants me to come and get her. Where is she? Dolby. Dolby, Louisiana. So... Dude, it's been three Dude. years. I know, I know, but what if it is her? I have to find out what happened. Also, like on the PC, because the, the PC and console leaderboards are separate. Obviously, the PC guys have um, faster loading screens, and they can also turn quicker and stuff. We've got quick turn, and I suppose they can use that too. But it's also a little easier to be accurate on the PC, I suppose, when you're shooting, and in areas that is pretty key. Uh, but yeah, I think the record for PC when I last looked was 1 hour 44, which is really good. So that's the full on best world record. But I don't think you, you're really going to struggle to beat that on the console just because of how. Sort of long, this you have to place. wait in areas for cutscenes and stuff. But, um, I heard he shaved another 12 minutes off that time, the guy who, who hit that. So it's like one hour 32, getting it down to an hour and a half, man. That is sweaty. God knows how he's doing that. But also, I was, I was watching the guy's hour and 44 run, and it did seem like he was running fast, faster than usual, but he isn't using the walking shoes. And then maybe it was just me being weird. But he's the guy whose sort of run I followed a little bit. His name's Trance, I think. It's a pretty decent speedrunner. Check him out if you have the time. If you're just looking for solid speedruns, I think it's like UH Trance or something. Have a little look for that guy if you find the time. Give him a quick shout out, considering he's helped me out a bit with this. Okay. So, keep running here towards the house. Keep following the path. Pretty straightforward in this area. We're not going to go for files or collectibles, even though I did get all the Mr. Everywheres yesterday to get the walking shoes. Which apparently gives you, um, 
increased movement speed, which would make speedrunning a lot more fun. So I don't know, if you're struggling to do the four hours for the achievement, you might want to go and get all the collectibles so you've got those shoes so you can move faster. Definitely going to use those in Madhouse. Although, the leaderboard speedrun thing for Madhouse is, um... You can't use any items. You can't use any unlockables, and that's just sweaty as fuck. Get yeah, straight into this room. Come over to the fireplace in the corner. Quickly press this switch. How you doing, Manning, and everyone coming into the chat? What's up, buddies? Hopefully, we can beat the console world record today. Or at least, the, I mean, it's more than likely going to get beaten, you know. There's going to be a lot of people tr probably trying to get the speedrun over the weekend. But um, if I can get on the leaderboard, I'll be happy. <laughs> There's a lot less people doing it on the console compared to PC, I guess, just because obviously if you're a speedrunner, PC's the way to go because it's faster. Damn it. The whole loading times and stuff like that. It's crunchy graphics too. Anyway, moving on. You follow in these hallways, we're gonna go into the, the gonorrhea water. Filled with a few teaspoons of super aids. And we all know that just one teaspoon of super aids in your butt and you're dead in two years. <clears throat> moving on. <laughs> The ripples in this area are horrible. It freaked me out the first time I saw it. But if you are looking for like a first time playthrough with all the cutscenes and everything included and me not talking shit over them, you might want to go check out my blind playthrough, which was like the first time through, and it took us a lot longer. It took us like nine hours or something, because I did not know what the fuck I was doing, but that's kind of the point. Definitely got all my reactions for the scares and stuff in there. It's great. We were talking yesterday about how this game's pretty much lost all of its scariness now, just because we've played it so much and we know it so well. Uh, but ah, well, it's still a great game. I loved it. Loved it first time through. Still love it now. It's great. And and also, if you haven't checked out the hard mode in this, like Madhouse mode, it changes a lot within the game. Like, there's locations of items that are different. Um, you have to collect antique coins to get yeah. certain things. And you want to grab those bolt cutters, use them on the door here to get to Mia. Um, also, yeah, it's it's sweaty. It's just really hard. You you also have like an ink ribbon type mechanic for saving. Oh, thank God I found you. So you need it's me. cassette it's tapes Ethan. to save. Ethan? Ethan? Are you all right? You shouldn't be here. What do you mean? You contacted me. No, no, I wouldn't. Did I? Did anyone see you? Did he see you? He. Who else is here? What the hell's going on? Daddy's coming. We need to go. Daddy? We need to go now! Right, so at this point we're pretty much just stuck behind Mia. So, just kind of stay close to her and follow her through. Invisible walls all over Where the place, you if you know me? what I'm talking about. Someplace safe. Are you going to tell me what's going on? Baby, you've been gone three years. Three years? Has it really been three years? Apparently so, Mia. We'll just grind up against you here, rubbing into your ass. It's fine. We've done it before. We'll probably do it again. She's not all blue waffly yet, so it's fine. What? What is this place? Spend an overlook. What'd they do to you? Not now. We need to get out of here first. I think it's this way. I'm fucking work it, baby. She's still bending over. <laughs> Work that ass. Come on. Visible walls, damn it. Come on. Moo. Still bending over. She's getting right up in there. Just giving it a bit of a twerp. Oh, no. She's just not. Mia, we have to talk. That message you sent me. Not me. That wasn't me. But you did. I didn't. Okay, fine. Just tell me what's going on. I'm telling you everything that I know. Telling you everything that I know. We have to go this So way. for anyone who's going for the free item box um, achievement during this, just take note that you can't actually use the item box and, um, apart from yeah. when the game lets you. Like there's free instances where you have to use the item Family box. Used to bring me food through here. That's all you can do. I remember. So you can't just use it as, as you see fit sort of thing. <laughs> But yeah, as this is the new game run, we're not allowed to use unlockables, so none of the unlockable weapons or anything like that. It's going to be a bit tougher, but it's fine. I'm also going to go for not healing at all. There. It's there. Although we can heal three times if we need to. But I'll try and do it without healing. 
Yeah, hurry the fuck up, Mia. We have seen this enough. So, she has a little investigation time around here. What I like to do is just come in here, look at these two dolls. That one. And then just stand here picking this one up and putting it down. And that triggers her eventually, I think. She, like, lies down on the couch. And then you should hear a scream, but... Usually happens when you're looking at this doll, so if you just keep picking it up and putting it down, hopefully you'll get it as soon as possible. Wait for it. Wait for it. There we go. Let's go. Right, she's gone now. Go through that hole in the wall. Up we go. And... We don't want first aid meds, but we need to go into this room where the first aid meds are. I'm not going to try... I'm going to try not to pick them up, just so... Um, oh god, open that, close it in my face. In here and out again. And then we hear banging in the basement, so back to the basement to see what Mia's doing. <laughs> okay. Here she comes. So pretty. Oh god. Hey baby, you look good. Three years has been good to you, mate. Right, so when it gives you the instant to mash the trigger, sort of relax. Yep, yep, yep. Resist. Mash, 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 mash. Stab through the hands. Fantastic. So right here, just quick turn and run. Yeah. Wait, wait. So you can get to this area. It triggers this little cutscene. Come at me, bro. I'm not sure where she actually stabs you there. Is it in the hand again? I think it's in the hand again. You see it healing, I think. I can feel her clawing her way back inside of me. Milka's here has changed his colour too. How you doing, Milka? Leave me alone! I've been back. I deserve this. Right, so at this point. What the fuck are you, Mia? The game wants you to have a little look around, so we'll grab the map here, and then go and check the door back here. And then she should stand up, maybe, I don't know. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> so grab your axe, the trusty axe of doom. Let's get to Shankin. Have you flag. Don't worry about guarding too much. There we go, once you get this, to keep mashing, punch her in the face. That's right. Now blue waffle away from us. <clears throat> I don't know how you managed to get blue waffle on your face, Mia, but you managed it. Right, so that's sorted, and then we're going to go down this way. And then I think if we come to this door... There we go. Phone call. You really shouldn't have come here. Who's this? Then what the fuck is going on? My name's Zoe. There should be a way out through the attic. Through the attic. attic. Go there. Now. She is not American, I swear. I swear that voice actor is not actually American. Right, so Mia's gone now. The axe is here if you want to grab it, but we're not going to grab it. We're just going to keep going. Um... Don't need that. I'm gonna be using the gun to kill that bitch. So, around and about we go. Let's go to the back here and use the bolt croppers we grabbed earlier on this little locker wardrobe closet thing that's in this hallway. <gasps> Terrible textures taking their time to load in. Give me that fuse. <clears throat> and there goes Mia. Looking creepy as ever. So, back to the room with the fireplace switch thing in it. Let's put the fuse in the box. Which is over now. Oh, shit. Ah, no, we do doing? Stupid, pressing the wrong thing. And then when we come back out here, we should get Mia jump out again. Ethan, it's okay. <clears throat> it's okay, it's me. I know you didn't mean to hurt me. You shouldn't have done that! Black eyes, man. It fucking hurts! Black eyes. Oh. 
His hand has taken a beating over the last few days for us. We've played this game a few times. <laughs> right, so you can grab the screwdriver now, but it doesn't make a difference until she gets close. So just wait for it. Now, let's see how you feel. So when she finishes that sentence, you want to go for it. Well then, you will get it. When in doubt, pull it out, and of course. <laughs> Creepy witch laugh. Under two hours, says Milka. I don't think so. This is the... We're going for the new game run right here, which is no unlockable items. I'm trying not to use any healing items again. No item box uses. So, yeah. Apologies if I'm not looking at the chat too, because I'm trying, gonna try and sweat this. But yeah, if you YouTube people, I'm, doing, I'm live streaming this, so... Try and do an intro that explains all of this malarkey, but you repeat yourself a lot doing this stuff. <laughs> right, so swing a right into this room and grab the gun and the bullets. There we go. We don't want the healing item, and then you can look away from this cutscene pretty early. And okay, fine. If you're doing this on a harder difficulty, you might want to grab the other bullets that are on the in the other room up here. But if you do it on an easy for the speed run, you just want to grab those bullets. You've got enough. To kill her now. A couple of steps up here and then straight back down. I'm gonna run over here. Try and shoot Mia in the face, although it is difficult to fucking do this. And she drops down, so. Aim for that head. Oh, we never stopped up. Ah, shit. Okay. So I'm trying to avoid getting hit there if you can. Although it isn't easy. But on easy, she doesn't take a lot of shots to kill. We go. She could run at us here. There we go. Run away from that bitch. A few more shots and she's done. There we go. I don't care what you love. So, if you reach this point without healing, then, um... You're fine. When you load into the next part of the game, you've got full health again, so... You don't need... Try not to heal. Basically, if you're going for that, no no healy thing, although we're going to try not to heal through the whole thing, which is hard. There are areas where that is difficult, but you keep walking into this box like this, eventually Jack shows up to punch you out. Welcome to the family, son. <clears throat> easy difficulty, yeah, we're doing it on easy. But it's a new game. <clears throat> so we need to, I think, I mean, the leaderboards probably haven't been updated properly, but the run we did yesterday was the console new game world record. I'm guessing there's a lot less people doing that. But we'll try and beat that today to get a better time on it. Because I, I did get turned around and I think we died a couple of times. Um, I mean, if you're going for that achievement for, for no heals or like less than three, just put it on easy and instead of healing yourself, if you die, just retry it. That's the easy way to do it, I feel. I mean, if you're going, I'm trying to, trying to do it with no deaths and zero heals, but it doesn't bother me too much if we die. I know I could slap that run we did yesterday. Come on. Don't you die Sky Force is here. How you doing, bud? You have work to do. <laughs> to be fair, we've only just started. We're like 17 minutes in, so... We're doing just fine. And again, another scripted cutscene here. We have to watch this one. Milka says it'll cheer me from my prompt. To be fair, I'm only going to be here for, for a couple of hours. Um, we're going to run through this once. Um, try, and, try and get the run done for YouTube. To post this. But next week, I'm going to start streaming to YouTube, I think rather than Twitch, just because I'll have more people over there that can watch. I know we've got a bigger audience over there. It's going to be better for us. Where? Where am I? What the hell? Rise and shine, sleepyhead. It's time for supper. Who, who are all you people? Where's Mia? Eat it. It's good. Fuck you, Marguerite. Bitch wasn't no good if it hit him. Oh, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Get out the way, Marguerite. Get out the way, Marguerite. Hit boy's got to eat. He got to have his supper. No. Come here, I don't boy. want it. Uh, looks like rotten guts. Like, what is that? What even is that, Jack? Shit, oh, shit, oh, shit. He's not eating it, Jack. He's not eating it. Can I see the menu, please? Get the hell out of here. You're a son of a bitch. Oh, I can't believe it. I'm not happy with what you bought me. I think the creepiest bit about this... Is Lucas's straight hard on face when Jack's cutting you? Like, look at Luke, look at him. He loves it. Oh, yeah, it's in a second. You can look at it. There we go. Here we go. Here we go. 
Straight hard on face. <laughs> <laughs> Look, like, so happy with it. God damn. I bet it's that cop again. God damn. Pigs. I'm coming back for you. Alright. So off goes Jack when he leaves. We want to uh, rock, look around and rock the chair if we can. Which will let us in a second, I think. Come on, let me out. I want to be free. I don't like being in here. Alright. Okay, so we're going to go straight out this door. And head this way. And Jack should show up when we turn this corner. We want to stick to the right heel. And try and swing around the back of it. We've got it nice and quick, which is good. Grab the key, spam X, and run the fuck away. Run the fuck away. And I crouch there by mistake. But then, we're going to run all the way to the back. Straight through this door. You only need to close one of these doors, so I'm going to close the first one. I don't actually think you need to close either, but I'm going to close that one. That will slow Jack down a little bit. Use our hatch key. We need to get the fuck out. He should burst through there any second. Oh no, he doesn't know where we are. Nice, we got away from him. Okay, lovely. Right, and then we want to go this this way. Yep, yep, yep. Under the house, into the back room. And if you're doing this on New Game Plus, this is where you can get your items, like your other guns and whatever. Which is nice. Everyone members. Everyone's nomming on their member berries today. The whole chat's saying I'm member, member, member. Need to remember this run. <laughs> okay, so uh, jump out. Then we're just going to walk outside here. Unlock this door. And then the phone rings. So we grab that. A couple of these phone calls we can skip, but a couple of them we do need to take. Zoe, right? And what the fuck are you? Shut up and listen if you want to stay alive. Stay alive. You've got to get out of that house. <laughs> I need a sample of Carmen because she just sounds like home. Carmen there. All right. Stay oh. alive. And that thing on your wrist is a codex. I love it. Don't lose it. It's important. I need to get that sample and compare them. You want to stay alive? Okay, so grab the map. Hell of a girl. Run out here. And then we want to quickly run down this corridor a little bit, I think. And then, I don't know the trigger for this fully, but pretty much you have to waste some time in this area. Then we're going to run to the back of this room. And there's some handgun, cheeky handgun bullets in here. Yoink. And head back out. I'm not sure what triggers this, like I said, but the cop comes to this window and you just need to listen out for the bangs. Come on, cop. No, that's the other windows banging away. Let's hope he's there now. If he's not here by the time you've done this a couple of times, just run in and out of the living room. And he should show up. I've seen some people just stand here and look at, um... Stand there and look at the fridge and eventually he shows up. Just keep running in and out of here and around this fucking corner. There we go, he's there now, I think. I think I just heard him. There we go. Hey, over here! So I just need to explore that area until he comes. Hey, you gotta help me. Hold on, back up. Now, sir, do you live here? I mean, is this your property? What? Me? No. No. All right. Now, we got several calls about some missing persons lately. You don't understand. I gotta get out of here. I calm down. You're not listening to me. There are crazy people in this house trying to fucking kill me. <laughs> well, all right. Let me tell you this. You don't exactly seem like you're playing with a full deck yourself, all right? Are you kidding me? Look, like I said, We've had several missing persons calls. And I can't rule out that an outsider like yourself may not be involved. All right. I'll tell you whatever you want. All right. Now, that's more like it. Now, meet me in the garage. We'll talk there. Hey, wait. You got to give me your gun. <laughs> you must have lost your mind. Look, officer. Deputy. Right. Deputy. Turtles is here, how you doing? Want to see Turtles. my name in the obituaries? Or do you want to be a hero and save my life? Right, so right here we get the pocket knife. A fucking pocket knife? Here. Take it. It's this cop needs a slap in the face, yeah. He's now go. Garage. Definitely a dumb bone. Now. Right, so you get some more handgun bullets just here. There's a couple what of ways to do this. Knife? I'm gonna do the way that takes a little longer, but um, only, only like it's minimal. It really doesn't take that much longer. But uh, we save bullets doing it, and bullets are important, damn it. So we open up the garage. 
But if you want to do this the quick way, you want to get into the car, wait for Jack to pull you out, and then when he starts driving it, hey, just shoot him in the, the face here, until though. he fucks up. You need to tell me what you're doing out here alone in the middle of the night. But I want to conserve me? ammo, so... What about you? No, it's my job. Why don't you do your job and tell me? Answer my question. Literally, it saves 15 you. seconds, right. something like that. It's a, it's hey, a little bit of time. What's that going like? Wait! It's up to you. This is the easy way. I'm going to run through the easier way, just in case any of you guys are struggling with the speed run. So then we're going to grab the gun, we turn around, and grab the car key that's on the sides, get in the car, quickly start up the car. Come on, then. That also takes the car key out of your inventory. And then we just want to run him over a couple of times. You don't have to come back that far. You just keep banging him out. I think it's like three or four times. You only really need to tap him. But when you get to the point where you can't see him anymore, I think that's it, you're done. If he doesn't get back up, just wait. Again, this is not the quickest way, but it's the easiest by far. Ah oh, shit! <laughs> nice car, Ethan. Cheers, dickbag. Fuck. <clears throat> Let's finish this, you and I. So again, it's a little bit quicker to, win, to let him drive. Shoot him in the face. Oh yeah, I'm gonna take you for a ride. This way easier. No, 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 no! no! <laughs> so you have to watch. It's a little longer because you have to watch this stuff and it skips basically to this point where you get out of the car if you just shoot him so and if you run get in the car and then just sit there and let him grab you out of it you can get to that a little bit quicker on madhouse mode though the location of the key changes which is pretty shit i'm gonna quickly slap this stuff up before he gets out first aid med we don't want that let's get rid of that while we have time yeah okay so I think you can avoid him here. Just keep running away from him and you get away with oh, not getting grabbed. Now look what you done, Just mother do your best to stay away from him. I'm pretty sure that works. Shoot him a couple of times if you need to. There we go. I'm sure if we take damage from that. But I think you take damage if he grabs you, so you don't want to do that. Right, let me quickly... Yeah, no, let's just leave. We'll just leave. I think there's, and there's another item in the corner, but we're not going to look for it. Look at Jack. He's <laughs> all over the bench. <laughs> he just disappeared. So if you go to the ladder, this is the cutscene here. You're about to see someone. If you don't have the handgun that the cop left, though, it appears at the bottom of the ladder, and you have to grab it before Jack will come at you because it's that gun that he blows his brains out. Anyway, let's grab these shotgun shells, and then we want to turn this bad boy around. Undo the nut there, turn it back around so that when it's done we can just grab it straight away. There we go. I'm going back down here. And now we can get into the house. Let's go, housey. Turn so we're facing the right direction, of course. Let's go. Right. So, now we're going to the house. Don't need to go and get anything, I don't think, from in here just now. I don't, I'm not sure if we have to come back. Yeah, we do. We do We do have to come back, but we're not going to worry about that just yet. Um, let's go ahead and slap the statue in we just got. Let us into our house. That's my house. And we're going to go straight to the right here, straight up these stairs. Ignore the phone call. Don't need to take that one. I'm going to follow the hallway here to the left and the right. All the way to the end of this corridor. Keep going. And I'm going to go straight into this room for the bathtub, get the statuette. Just press X on that and then give it a second. Thank you. Then we're back out here, we'll have another cutscene with Jack. Heck of a thing, man. This sure shit beats the hell out of dying. Fuck you, Jack. So... Head around the left, and you can drop down the stairs on your left there, but you don't want to do that because he follows you, and it's a lot harder just to, to get moving. So, this is the way you want to go, pretty much the way you came. Bust open the door, straight back downstairs, and then you want to go drop the statue, or the statuette, on this. Quickly figure out this puzzle. This is relatively simple. Other way, 180 that. Oh, I think that's about right. No, I don't like it. Keep going. Uh, 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 uh. 
That'll do. Right. Now that that's done, let's go. Who builds this shit? Who builds this shit? <clears throat> Audio is a bit out of sync, it seems. Well, oh, never mind. The YouTube run will be fine. It'll all get sorted for YouTube. So straight through here to the left. And then through here as well. Straight through this door. Keep pushing. Run past this mess that comes out the wall. What the? Just don't even bother with the doors. Just keep going. And then <clears throat> we're going to go straight downstairs. We've got a bit of a sweaty bit to do here. The first one. You might want to be ready to guard on one of these corners. I think it's not this corner. It's the next one, isn't it? Pretty sure it's this corner. If you take, want to take it wide, get your guard up, block that attack, get in here, close this door really quick, come on. Then you want to open up this red one, and the one at the end, and then avoid this guy again. If you need to get your guard up, do it, but we're going to open this, quickly grab the key, and we're off. Forget those guys, just run. Try and get past that other door. And then we'll come into this door, straight through here, and we're going to go take on Jack. So, want to head to our right. Avoid that guy. There's a few zombies in here, so you want to be quick. A few molded motherfuckers. Put the key in. You took a hit there. Door open. Come on, you're being too slow. Go, go, go. Straight down the stairs. And then uh, there's some shotgun shells you want to grab just here on the shelf. When you come back here a little later, a liquor bursts through that uh, wall. Just a reminder. Keep going up the stairs. Round here, we're going to grab this first dog's head. Yeah, boy. And then Jack should jump us. Bam! Okay, so now, run away from Jack. And you want to shoot him in the face as much as you can here. You don't actually need to aim most of the time. Just keep going for it, but you can if you want. Also, it takes you out of aim when you shoot. Ah, don't let him grab you. Oh, he's got me. Guard up. Shoot him. There we go. Keep shooting him. Ah. Don't think we did it enough to get his... It's close. Six bullets. He missed. There we go. So now hit him with everything you have. If you run out of bullets, knife him. Do as much damage to him there as you can. And now we should go for a saw. And when you've got the saw, you pretty much just don't take any damage unless you're unlucky, really. There's also a first aid med in the corner if you want it. We're going to grab the chainsaw here and just get to thrusting at him. Don't do the normal attack. Just do the thrust. Oh, he hit me there. Oh, shit. My bad. I think I fucked it up there. And when he's going for you, um, you pretty much lock his chainsaw with yours. Keep doing that until you end up ramming it into his face. Also keep an eye on the yellow light here. Oh, he hit me with that one, I think. Keep an eye on the yellow light. Because um, that indicates when your engine of the chainsaw is about to stall in the sun. No face. Again, thrust him as much as you can in his face here. You're unlucky the chainsaw. Down. Run away. Run away. Ah, no, we're flashing. Please don't kill me, Jack. Please don't. I don't want to use help. Oh, well, I didn't get it started. Shit. Get ready for this. Blocked. I think he's close. Pretty sure he's close. Keep giving it to him. Keep going. Suck it, Jack. Get blocked. Okay, we've got walking speed back. We're not flashing anymore. Good time. Ah, I know we are close. It's gonna stall in a second. Though. He's definitely close to dying. Go again. Have it, Jack. There we go. Jump, Jack, done with. He said jump it. Yeah, the chainsaw is key to that fight. Boom. And you've got a couple of seconds to look around this room before it actually lets you open the door. You've got a med there. I don't think there's anything else we need, though. There's a herb on the floor. Is there anything in this one? Any bullets? No? All right, we're off. See, it doesn't let you open it straight away, so you do actually have a few seconds to scan around that room. <clears throat> right, then 
rough. Open up. Let's go. Straight out of here then. So now, all the enemies that were lurking around this area, now you've killed Jack are gone. Also, we have a nice little break from Jack. He's not chasing us around the house anymore. So straight back out here the way you came, through the boiler room. And then we want to head, when we get out of this room, I think to our left. And then we can get the scorpion key. I think there's a couple of shotguns, you know, handgun bullets in there we can grab. I'm not sure if there's shotgun shells. I'll have a look. I know there's some handgun bullets in the boxes in front of you when you come through. Okay. Let's give this a slash. Handgun bullets. I'm not sure what's in the... Some more here. Handgun ammo. Yeah, we need that shit. So, let's grab up scorpion key. Also, if you're running low, you can always just grab those bullets before you fight Jack. And we want to open this door. This gives us a really fast route back out here. Close that door before behind you, because I'm not sure if liquors spawn there. I don't think they do at this point. But there's Evelyn singing Go Tell Out Road and Rody, which is great. <laughs> Use the scorpion key here. Crank that open, and then we want to go... Oh, yeah, quickly grab the clock pendulum. I'm going to go back this way really quick. And go back to the living room where we got those uh, bullets in the back of that room and grab the uh, the other dog's head. Oh, through here. Let's do it. To the very back. Put that clock pendulum in that we just got. That's dog head number two. Lovely. Keep going here. And then um, let me just, I wanna check my item slots. Have we got four? Yep, okay, we got five. That's beautiful. Let's keep running. And we want to go upstairs to where the shotgun is. So again, we'll swing a right up here. Oh, well, the broken shotgun is. And the last dog's head that we need. So let's crank that open. Swing through here to the left again. And we want to go to the left in this room and grab the book. Get the dog's head. Come over here. Open up this room. There we go. And we want to grab the shotgun. Or at least the broken shotgun. Grab that and the shotgun shells that are on the bed. And then we're going. We're going back downstairs. And we want to put all three dog's heads in the door. So we've got enough space to grab the other shotgun. The, the uh, working shotgun. Let's keep going. I don't think we have enough space, do we? Oh yeah, we do, we're good. We can just do it now, yeah, good shit. We can just do it now. Gimme. <clears throat> Five bullets. And we'll put in the broken one. <clears throat> and we're off. And that's the house done, pretty much. The first bit of the house. I'm getting shit pop up on my screen now, which is annoying. Dog's head's in. <clears throat> Let's do this thing. So, we want to go into the trailer here, but also we want to hit quickly head behind the trailer. Grab these shotgun shells, member. And then we're going to head back around this way. And you want at least eight bullets for the shotgun at this point. And you, as you leave, you get a phone call. We're going to quickly grab that phone call. You made it. You're the first I've ever seen make it this far. So what is it you need me to do? Is it going to help me get out of here? Yes. Now listen carefully, Ethan. My family and I, our bodies are contaminated. I can't leave the property unless I get it out. And the same goes for Mia. Is there a way to get it out? We need the serum. It should clear whatever this stuff is out of the body. As long as you're not too far gone. All right. So where is it? If I knew where one was, I'd already be long gone. But I have a feeling my mother has hidden some inside the old house somewhere. So if we get this thing, I can help me and we can get out of here? Right. And so can I. The old house is near the water. We can't miss it. All right. I just hope you can handle my mother. I can handle your, your mother. mother. She's a puss. Be careful. They'll be looking for you. Right. So now we're going to go deal with Marguerite. That's this way. I'm going to head to the left out of the trailer. Straight towards um, the gate down here, the doll bridge. Right now. Q. 
keep running. I think there's some bullets. Is it bullets? I think it's either a herb or bullets. I can't remember. First aid med here. We don't want those. So we're going to head this way. Straight through here. And usually you'd go and get the burner to get through this bit. But you don't actually need to. You just want to use the shotgun. So we're going to keep coming around here. We haven't got Marguerite about at the moment, which is nice. Very nice. We want to go through this door. And then head over to this one. And I think you get attacked by a swarm of these little things. So puff them. Get as close to this thing as you can and bang it in the face. And then you want to go under here. And again, we're limping now. We've got low health. But keep running. We can fucking do it. We want to go get the statuette that's here. Mia is there, but fuck her. Let's go. We've got that health back now. Now we've got the statuette. And once, you, once you've got the statuette here, um, Marguerite comes. So you want to come over to this door and she'll show up. being called by people now. Go away. <clears throat> okay, so now we want to go back the way we just came under. Make sure you duck under this thing, otherwise it sends the bugs after you. And we come out here. And we want to come straight out this door, I believe. Oh, no, 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 wrong door. No, no, wrong door. This way. Sorry. We might have to run past Marguerite here, but she's dumb as fuck. She's lost us, apparently. We just ran straight past her. Close this, close this door and you're safe from the bugs and her as well, and you can do this without her interrupting you. I'm not paying attention, bitch. Okay, so spin this round. Uh, it's about there, isn't it? Yep. So now we want to go through here. As quick as we can, because Marguerite's German. Yeah, she don't like us. Also, if you want to get the bag upgrade, you can fuck, grab it fuck, from fuck, where fuck. the other half of the burner is, which was just ahead of us where we put the statue in. You go outside that way and take a left and straight to the back, and there's a, a, the, the first bag upgrade, I think. But we're not going to go for that. We're just going to get the second and third one. All right, so now we're here. We want to run straight past all of this stuff and down this hole. And then we can go and grab the crank. Which is at the back of here. I think there's a herb in here as well if you are looking for health items. Oh no, it's psychostimulants. Yeah. Grab the crank. And then we're off. There's also a Mr. Everywhere next to us there. Watch out for this little fucker that's hanging around down here. Kill him. And then we want out. We're going to quickly go and lower this bridge. Raise this bridge, should I say? Keep going. There is actually an achievement for shooting Marguerite enough in this area. Um, and making her run away back into the house. So we need to go to the kitchen here, which is through this way. Marguerite's still about, so be careful. Ah, there she is. Look how dumb she is. Like, you're so dumb. Oh no, she hit me there. She hit me. Close the door. Close the door before we die. Close the door before we die. I'm not sure if those little fuckers can actually kill you, but let's be quick about this and use the crank. They can't hurt us while we're using the crank to fuck them. Oh no, we got hurt. We got hurt there, definitely. Oh, shoot this thing. Shoot it. There we go, it's gone. We're good, we're good, we're good. Walk it off, walk it off. <laughs> Uneasy, it is pretty difficult for you to die, but like I said, if we do die, it doesn't really matter. We'll still get a good time. I'm just going for no med kit uses. And we want to grab the key from here. Hopefully, yeah, there we go. So we're back to walking speed now. <laughs> we can run a little. So there are certain times throughout the game anyway where you get your health back. You we're are. going back this way now. Run away from Marguerite. We're going to go underneath this thing again. And back through this door. I think. Oh, no, 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 no. Turned around. Turned around. That was stupid. Yeah, no, no. We can go this way. We can go this way. No, yeah, no, this was right. I was right. Yeah, I was right the first time. I'm just being derpy. Keep going. Over to this crow door. And she should jump out on us now. I told you to stay out of here! There's been, so, like, literally, most of the time, you can just run past Marguerite. She's really stupid. Anyway, let's get the pistol out here. There we go. Right, Shoot her in the I'm face as much as you can. Let's get down to business. If you don't let her finish her sentence as well, then she doesn't get the bugs out on you. 
Just not the uh, little shitty ones, she gets these ones out. Which you can stab if you want. And they can be fuckers to kill. It's good to go for those when she's like far away from you. Die. There we go. Keep hitting her. Everything you got. Try and slash a little bug bitch as well. Until she comes back. They are hard to hit. <laughs> Reload. I, w I don't want to waste my shotgun bullets on her. Let's just keep going for her. This is what you there we go. Oh no, no, she's not done yet. She's not done. These bugs can kill us, so we want to be careful. This is beyond the pale. Do you hear me? Beyond the pale! There we go. Got her. Now we just climb up. As soon as those bugs ah! blow up, it's a good indicator that she's done. Fuck your light. So we'll use the um, crow key on this. In we go. And then we want to open this up. What the? And grab look at this quickly. And then we should get a phone I think call. That's it. Well, did he find a serum? I just got done dealing with your mom and her fucking bugs. Wish you could have warned me. <laughs> Sorry about that. What about the serum? I haven't found any, but I did find out we need to make one. A D-series head and an arm. This can't be right. A head? I think I have that around here somewhere. You do? I don't know about the arm, though. Have you searched the whole house? No, not yet. I still need to check the second floor here. All right. Check it out. Meet me at the trailer if you find it. Okay, so now that that's done, we're going to run over to the left here. We want to run to the back of this area. Quickly check this out. There's also a Mr. Everywhere right there if you want it. And I should say the scale and the door are connected. We're going to head back. And to where we came from. And she should be doing one. Now we have to go fight Marguerite. Believe us, the blue waffle is real with Marguerite. If you haven't seen it yet, god damn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so straight down here, you get a good view of the waffle there if you look closely. <laughs> so gross. Well, that's special. That's special, apparently. That is not special, even. Right, so out we go. I'm not sure what the shotgun bullet situation is at the moment. <clears throat> so we're going to go up these steps to the right. Really quick. Keep it moving. And just drop straight down. Can have a little look around for bullets if you want. I think I'm going to go and grab some shotgun bullets. Um, and we want to come to... There's some bullets at the back here, usually. Or it can be med sometime. Handgun ammo, that's lovely. And uh, to the right, there's a cage. You have to slice all the spiders off in order to get to the bullets. So just stay... If you stay at the right length away, they, can't, they won't jump off at you. So just stand here and knife them off. Just take them out. I know it's not very speedy, but we need these bullets. There's also some strong chems there if you want them, but I just want the shells, and we've got ten now. So, uh, right here, I'm going to save my shotgun bullets for the right moment. When you come up the stairs, she'll burst through the window, and you want to step back, pop her in the face. Try not to let her grab you. Oh, okay, there we go. And, and we come up. We're going to quickly run around here. There's some more bullets in the corner. Oh, nice. Meds. All right, nice. Okay. I guess that randomizes. Last time that was bullets. <laughs> but now we want to go find her and fuck her up. This is the, one of the longer boss fights in the game. She's on the stairs here, which is easy for us. Yeah, she's escaping. Okay. Sometimes there's some shotgun bullets out here too, but when she runs away like this, you want to listen carefully for where she is. Or run around and get bullets. Which is what I'm going to try and do here. Shotgun shells, you beauty. Same sort of spots tend to have shells at times. Where is she? She's above us. There she is. Thank you, bitch. Get down. The waffle! The waffle in my face! The grim margarine. Oh shit, I've been eaten. Now we're hurt. Try and take out her bugs if you can, but... If you're doing the same as me in, in the sense of not trying to heal when she hits you or something, just move away, run away, get your health back to the point where you can run again. And uh, I think this is pretty much the... 
one of the more difficult fights. Jack, if you do it in a certain way, the last fight with Jack, it's quite easy. Where is she? She just wanted to fucking DDT me off the wall, which she likes to do. Fucking... Where is she? There she is. I see her now. So yeah, if she's running up the wall like that, get your distance. The fucking shooter in the back. Ah, shit. No bad shooting for us. Keep blasting her. Bye, Marguerite. Oh, we did it. We done it. No. Fuck away from me, Marguerite. Run, 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 run. Oh, that was lucky. I think she just ran away. Okay, give me that health back. This is definitely one of the longer fights, just because she runs away, and it's hard to keep up with her at times. Especially when I'm not healing, and I'm all, all over the place. Let's drop down. I can hear her giving birth to some bugs, which, yes, she fucking does. It's gross. Where is she? Come here, Marguerite. I'm surprised you can't smell the waffle from here. There's also some psycho supplements on the chair behind you if you want to grab those and look for items. And that couch in the other corner. Hey, Marguerite, I know you're nearly dead. Where are you? Here I come! Oh shit, she's coming. Oh, there she is. You missed. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Oh, fuck! Oh, shit. She grabbed us. Unhealthy again. Oh no, she could kill us here. Don't kill me. She's close, I can feel it. Oh, run, 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 run. She's coming. I'm stuck in the corner. Oh, and we're done. Oh no. She's getting the waffle in my face. Look, look at the waffle in the face there. Did you see it? God knows how we're still alive, but I need my health back. Oh shit. I know she's close, man. Run. You are not jumping on me, bitch. I'm out of bullets for the shotty. Come back here, Marguerite. Uh oh, she's on the wall. If she jumps at us, we're fucked. So let's not let that happen. I think she might have gone into the wall. Okay, we've got the health back. Feeling more positive. This is definitely one of the less scripted fights. It's way harder to do. Is she above me? Oh my god, she's above me. Oh, you bitch. Please don't kill me, Marguerite. We've got most of the way through this fight. That might be it. I'm out of bullets now. Yeah, I don't think she's dead, though. Need to run. We need more bullets. Let's go upstairs. I'm back into the gardenish area. There's some more bullets over there, I'm pretty sure. We can finish her off with. Yesterday, I think we finished her with a knife because we ran out too. Oh god, she's here. She's fucking here, you bitch. That's where my bullets are too. Come on, give me my health back. Handgun bullets, 21. Get to it. She's gotta be close, man. Look at the way she moves, it's so gross. Yes! Nice! Oh, she's still not done. Oh my god, I thought we had her there. So full of shit, Marguerite. Okay, it's back to the knife. It's knifey, knifey time. There may be more bullets around, but I don't know where they are. Oh, there we go. Very nice. Handgun ammo. I think that's all the ammo spot, but she has got to be close, man. She takes so long to kill. I wish I knew the fastest way to kill her, because I haven't experimented with this fight too much. But like I said, it's not scripted, so... She's here somewhere, I can hear her. There she is. Oh god, run away. Please don't kill me. Oh no! We're not dead, I don't think. Run, run, drop down, drop down. Fucking bugs up my ass, man. No heals, no heals, damn it. This bug's chasing me, though. So she. Oh my god. No, Marguerite. Oh, we do it! Did we do it? Yes! Fucking suck it, Marguerite! Suck it! So happy. <laughs> that fight definitely took us about 10 minutes. Fuck you. And that, I guess, I think without healing, that's probably the trickiest fight in the game. Let's fucking stay dead, okay? Because she can mess you up. So, there's some more bullets in this room there. Chuffed that we beat her there, though. 
if you are, if you know, that's probably a good place to um, plan a plan a heal if you need to heal because you have three. We're gonna go for none though, just a little bit more of a challenge. What's here anyway? Is that bullets that are there? Oh, there's another strong chem fluid there if you want it. Let's go. So, oh shit, no, no, wrong way, dummy, dummy, not through there, not through there. It's good to unlock that though, so you can come back this way if you need to. Let's go back and jump down this sewer. So we can get back and put the lantern in its place to get the D-series arm. Lost a few seconds there, but that's fine, just fine. Keep running. Right. So the weak point for Marguerite is obviously the blue waffle, but it's kind of hard to hit when she's like crawling around, unless you can get behind her. Ah well. I'm happy we did that. We didn't have to resort to the knife this time. So back through here. I'm going to put the lantern in its place on the scale. Hit the piano playing itself there. Do, 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 do. <laughs> there we go. Let's go. Open up. Open up! Okay, so we want to go left through here, I think. Oh, no, what? oh, yeah, behind the thing there and then left. Swing to our right to get through to this door. And then keep pushing right. Left, hard left through this area. It's pretty dark, so it's kind of hard to see. The doors closing on themselves. The whole screen should go black now. And we should hear stay away. We want to get as close to this door as we can. Stay away. I'm not sure if you can keep moving forward while this is going on, but keep running. Through here, behind the bed. Through the little notch on the door. Or the wall, sorry. Grab the D-series arm. This bit is going to suck because we have no shotgun ammo, by the way. Oh, God. I guess this is it. You can try, though. There's only one bit of this area that's difficult. We've got handgun bullets. There's Evelyn. Let's run away from her. We should have a monster behind this door, and we want to try and knock him back. Like that, and run past him. There we go. Come on, let me past you, dick. Get your guard up if you need to. Go. Oh, God, I have my guard up. You're lying. Can't get past him. Could easily kill me here. There we go. There we go. Come on, you've got to be dead now. Still not dead. There we go. Right. Still not dead. There we go. Had to kill that one, which I really didn't want to. Keep running. Hopefully, we get a little bit of health back. We got to stick to the right here. We're going really slow, so this might be more difficult than usual. And we're going. Hopefully, nothing hits us. Swing around this chair again. Back out the way we came, to our left. There's a guy here, please don't hit me, mate, please don't hit me. I'm gonna close this door just to be safe. There we go, back out, lovely. Wasted a lot of pistol ammo there, but I don't care. We got this. Got that D-series arm. So now we have to go back to the trailer, and we're limping like fuck. Ignore the phone call. Keep fucking going, just keep fucking moving. Go, 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 go. Go, go, go. Go, go, go. <laughs> Limpy McGee. Back through here. We can take the underground route if we want. <clears throat> I could be... I'm probably losing a bit of time here because I'm limping, but I'm going for no heals. So, no health items whatsoever. We are actually coming close to a point where we get our health back, which is nice. So, to the trailer. And... Jump in here quickly and look in the fridge. And we're going to look at this really quick. There we go. I'm not sure if we actually have to look at that or we can just go. But let's go. We have to go to the dissection room now. Are they handgun bullets? No, it's a hub. Okay, through we go. We want to go to our left. <clears throat> and then we're going to swing it to our right. Can we just? I'm just going to quickly check in this room and see if there's any bullets. I don't think there is. I think we checked yesterday and I don't think there is. Oh, it needs a lockpick. Fuck it, go, 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 ignore the room, ignore the room. Could use a shotgun bullet or two here, but we're going to try and run past everything again. Which isn't easy, I know, but we want to go through here. And then swing it left. Swing it right. Keep pushing. Oh yeah, handgun bullets. Sneaky handgun bullets. Thank you, eight bullets. That'll do. There's a licker that appears ahead of you in this area, and he's a bit of a bitch to dodge. So just be careful when you're coming through. Be on that guard with the lickers, because they do a lot of damage. Alright, so through here. And then, yeah, around this corner. Should have a licker. 
or the four-legged molded, whatever you want to call them. Try to run past him. Keep running. Keep running. He's got us. Keep going. Keep going. You want to get in this room? What was that up? There we go. We're safe for a second. Just grab the key. Grab the key, dummy. Stop looking at the wrong thing. Ah, no. Well, let me look at it. Fucking get the key, Ethan. What are you doing? There we go. Dumb, dumb. Milka says I'm still fast. Well, this is new game, so. And again, I'm going. For, it's really an achievement Something run because I'm trying to show people how to do the speed run. No item boxes, no heals in one run. But I would like it to be a half decent run. If we do die, it doesn't matter really because we're still going to beat the time. It's like four hours. So now that we got the snake key, we're going to come out to the right. Avoid everything down here. Keep running. I'm going to open up this key. Door with the key we just got. Snake key. Some shotgun shells ahead of us here. Come on. There we go. Shotgun shells. Thank you for some of that. And then we're going to head up here. There's also a chem in this uh, little locker thing if you want it. We're going to head out of here, right out of this, and then we're going to go left back through the door we came. Avoid the liquor if you can. Son of a bitch, get out of my way. Oh, he's going to kill me. He's going to kill me. Close the door. Yes. Okay, keep going. No heels for the win. No heels, that's what I'm saying. Keep going. No heels, no deaths would be nice, but... That's, uh... Wishful thinking. So now we've got two of these guys to avoid. And I have low health, so this is going to be hard. We need to bring this one around the table. Ring around a Rosie with him a little bit. If you've got better health, you can just run past him. But he's going to fuck me up if I do that. So keep going this way. Should be alright. Go to the left here. Hopefully I'll get my health back in a second. Fingers crossed, anyway. We're going to use this key. Let's go. Okay, into Grandma's room. And close the fucking door. Oh, whatever, you can close it yourself. Open up this and grab you the bag. That's the second bag upgrade, I think. Change the clock to quarter past three. And we're going to go get that first key card. Off we go. I might load up my shotgun. I know we've only got two bullets, but just in case. We get screwed, keep running. I'm going to go and get a key card from in here. I'm pretty sure we don't get attacked in this area. Or do we? Oh yeah, we have to run back through there. Oh my god. Just want to have a look, see if there's any bullets around. Oh, is that hang enhanced handgun ammo? Oh, that'll come in useful. Alright, so we're going back through. There's no bullets there. Okay. Back through the area we ran through a minute ago. So we want to run straight ahead. Again, we've got to avoid that liquor, which sucks, I know, but... We got this. Oh no, it's not a liquor anymore. Nice. Back through here. Back here again. Swinging it back to the main hall. We need to go upstairs again to unlock the other snake door to get the other keycard. This time I'm pretty sure both of these guys are upstairs. Let me see. Yeah, so again, there's one there and one there. Let's go this way. We can do this if we go this way. Keep going. Just watch out for that guy's coming back. <laughs> Go through here, and we're going to unlock this door again, with a snake key. Right. Did I say quarter past three? <laughs> Is it 10.15? Oh, doop 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 that's stupid. <laughs> that's me not paying attention. I was saying that yesterday too. Now we know. 10.15, Caught me going quarter past three, that's derpy. <laughs> doop doop Anyway, up into the attic after pressing that button on the lamp, and then we're going to go and grab this little motherfucker, and we got to wiggle this around till it's in the right place, I think. Is that it? No. It's only a few different directions it can be. That's not either. What about the other way? Yeah, that's it, but it's the wrong way around, so rotate that shit. Oh no, it's still, yeah, we need to 180 it. There we go. Oh, what? Oh no, it's not close enough. Maybe this angle. Come on, be nice. Be nice now. Is that good enough for you? Nope. We're like really not far off it. Come on, I don't want to get stuck here. There we go. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Give me the other key card. Please. And we're going to head back. I think now that you've got those, the guys that were spawning in the main hall, don't spawn anymore, those two molded things. <sighs> And we're leaving back out here then. And 
straight out this door. And then we're going to go see Lucas, pay him a little visit. Hope you're ready for it. <laughs> Ignore this phone call. Just keep running. We have liquors here. I forget about these guys. That's one. There's another one over here. I'm going to get my enhanced ammo out for this. Because these guys can mess you up. In the air. Wasted a couple of bullets, but that's fine. Switch back to my normal ones. Put these key cards in. There we go. Up we go. We have sort of a cutscene here with Lucas. Yesterday we had some weird glitch thing happen with this, where it ended like a good 30 seconds early. And I think I didn't press anything after I sat down, so I'm going to try that again today and see if we just sit there and watch. Do we get away with this? I know we're still going pretty fast. We're doing. We've got a good run going here. To be fair. Ethan. 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 Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I got some for you. Looky, looky, what I've got. <laughs> You know what this is for? You know what Zoe wants to do with this? <laughs> Freem's going Ooh, for under two hours today. I don't know if we'll make under two hours, but this is the... Mm -mm. Mm -mm. We're going for the new game run, which means no unlockable no, items, all that stuff. That ain't special. This... This right here... is special. You see... Ethan! Everybody wants to turn back the clock. What? What, Evelyn? Yeah, for some reason, last time the I'm just trying to show the him. TV cracked here. I'm just trying to show him. To like everybody wants to go back to how things were. That was a stupid bitch. No idea how it happened, but it did. I don't want to go back to how things were before my father found y'all. Shut up, Lucas. Now everybody wants to turn back the clock. So, so Ethan. Ethan, you can, uh, you can, um, crawl around underneath that filthy, rotten house all you want looking for them ingredients, but you ain't gonna find a goddamn thing, Ethan. Ethan. Ain't that serum? Ooh, baby. <laughs> You're gonna have to come through me. You hear? Fuck you. Oh, come on, Ethan. What do you say? I say I'm coming for you, freezing boom. I wish it would give him my health back because my screen looks all nice, but I get the blood spat back now. Me. Fuck! Let's go. Okay, so we want to watch out for traps in this area, of course, but you can duck most of them, and we're trying to conserve ammo. Is that, are they bullets? No, 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 no bullets. Through here then, and I'm not sure if we want to blow that one up or not. Should we see if there's bullets in it by shooting it? I oh, okay, fuck, I shouldn't. That's a waste of a bullet. You got a good. Could have just shot the box. Alright, let's go duck under that trap too. We can duck under this one. Run a little bit. And then we come to this corner. And we can shoot this one. Or we need to shoot this one. Uh, avoid the one that's in front of you there. And we can open this without it blowing up in our face, I'm pretty sure. First aid med, we don't want that. Just keep going. Um, I don't think we want to blow that one up. I'm pretty sure it blows up in our face. And then we want to come here and just destroy this one. And there's another one running across the door, so just stick to this corner. For the and then we're going to go... Guess I'm gonna have to step up my just press the dot here. I know. After when we can. Fucking password, right? Mm, why don't you try 0814? No! 0621. No, 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 no. It's 0514. Oh, come on! Take a chance, you never know! <laughs> right, so we're just gonna put in a f the decimal there, enter, and that's what we need to do. Tick, 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 just wait for tock, this thing to slam tick, down. Tick, 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 tick. Okay, so now that's done, back to this. Just put in anything, and then this door will open. I need to find the password. 
if you know the passcode from a previous run and you put it in, it actually changes. But in this area, we're going to run pretty much to the end. Um, can we open this? I think we can. Yeah, first aid med. No, no good to us. And there's a trap down at the bottom here. Just about here. Stuck under that. And just keep running here. There's a liquor that spawns behind you, so you don't want to stop in that hallway. But just keep running. A lot of stuff spawns here. You can just run past it all, though. Um, some gunpowder. I'm gonna go oh, God, you son of a bitch. You hear me. That's all good, though. We don't have to fight anything up here, so we're fine. I would go in that safe room and check for bullets, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to keep going, keep limping away here. Yeah. Uh, uh, uh. There's a few th uh, little things you can search for here for ammo. The only one of them blows up, and there's one of them here. First aid man, I'll we'll discard that quickly. Back we go, and so there's, yeah, there's I think there's three boxes you can smash. Usually one of them has some ammo in for you. Shotgun shells, just what we needed. Okay, up we go. There's another box in the corner. We got our run speed back. Grab the battery. Smack that. More shotgun shells. Thank you so much. And we don't want to smash that one because it's explosive. So then we go down. Slap the battery in. Get it. Get in there, you. There go run away. Ah! Then we're going to come over here, get our handgun out. I'm not going to use my enhanced ammo just yet. Ladies this guy starts coming down and we get shot on him, so... Go for that place. The phone's ringing again. Go away. Stop bugging me. So, now we switch to the shotty, slow that up. We've got like 14 shots, this shouldn't be too difficult. Fuck you too. Avoid his puke, is all I'm going to say to you. <laughs> Not happy with us. Then come around this corner. It's gotta be close. I might save some shot ammo and use my enhanced. Run up here to retreat if you need to. Thinking he hasn't got much left in him. Ah. Shotgun it is. Stand here. There we go. You have all your fingers in my face, though. So avoid him when he's gonna blow up. Fat man down, fat man down. So let's get up here. Okay. I think yeah, we're going through this. No no no, we're going through this way. Open up and run straight through here. Take a quick glance at the passcode there. You can grab a cam if you want it to. 1408. Let's go and press the button here to lower the stairs. Kind of like a bloater. Yeah, or a boomer. And down we go. Right, we're going to avoid this trap. I don't think that trap's there anymore, but I'm going to avoid it anyway, just in case. So is it 1408? And that'll open it for us, but now we have our first box use. We only can only use three. We've got to put everything in here, so make sure you don't fuck this up. Yep, 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 get rid of all that. And just put everything you have in there. There we go, and then the door will open. And Lucas slams us in, but we want to just grab the candle as quick as we can. Have a nice day. And set this off, so quickly turn around. Why well, you know turn around even? There we go. Run into here. And this sets off the lights and shit. I'm just gonna come and stand and wait here for a minute until Lucas stops talking. Alright, what do you say we play a little game? 1408 is a good movie. Candle and put it on the cake. Kiss my ass! Ethan Language! There are children in the building. Somewhere. I think. I'm not sure anymore. <laughs> Alright, light this up. And then we're gonna light our candle. There we go. Candle is lit. And now we're headed this way. Just quickly burn this rope. <clears throat> Get in here. I'm gonna run to the back. 
put the password into this, which is loser. Get that done. Okay. Sorted. Bang that open, grab the valve, and then we're leaving. Quickly run around this corner, and we want to head into here and use the valve. <clears throat> and then we want to go light the candle one more time. This will turn off the water sprinklers so we can put the candle on the cake. Oh, there we go. Run, 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 run. Let's put that in. I left my fucking window open. Okay. The stupid thing is you learn that from uh, watching of one of the videotapes and you see it blow up in the guy's face but Ethan still stands there like, yeah mate. So you want to rip this plank off the wall. <clears throat> and put this in there. I think it takes about 15 seconds and you just want to come chill around this corner. Until it goes boom. Boom. <laughs> right. We want to grab our items back here. So this is the second item box used. Make sure we don't fuck up. Grab the D-series head. We actually forgot the D-series head yesterday after getting all our stuff back on one of the runs. Let's open this up. And we want all of our shit. So we, we need the G-17 handgun. The knife. The shotgun. We don't need the keys. Shotgun shells. We don't need the keys. Crank. D-series arm. I think that's everything we need, isn't it? It is. We actually don't have a lot of ammo, but the sneaky ammo over here. So we're going to grab sneaky ammo there, the six shotgun shells, which is always nice. And there's some handgun bullets here too. Lovely, because we need those. And let's quickly drop in our crank. So this bit's a bit difficult. You want to be quick here if you can. You get a couple of liquors in your face, which isn't fun to deal with, I know. You can do it without killing anything. I'm coming near. Um, so we'll try our very best and see what we can do. Although we could die here. Hopefully not. <laughs> now the great thing about doing this is if, if you do die, you just hit retry and you just spawn like a little bit behind where you just were. So we've got good time here, so I'm not bothered if we do die a couple of times. Jack is really the sweaty bit. Right, so some stuff in there if you want to go get it, but we don't. We're just going to move on. We want to slash up uh, this box. Fuck statements. Eh. Okay, there's sometimes some shotgun shells in that building, but I'm gonna avoid them. I'm just gonna get this moving again. We've got a fucking run here. Fingers crossed, ladies, because this is another tricky bit with the liquor. Yeah, there he is. Okay, to the right. Go, 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 go. I know it's kind of hard to see. Ah, I don't think he got us. Keep going. Keep going. That's good news. That's good. If we get hit here, we should be fine. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Go, 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 go. Keep running. We got another liquor that jumps out now. We need to run past him, the prick. Move it, liquor, you knob. Ah, oh, you son of a bitch. Another guy that comes now. We need to get past him really quick. Come on, come on, go. Yes. Once you're in here, you're safe. Grab your flame rounds from here. And grab the shotgun shells and head up. And then uh, we need to talk to these guys. Quickly approach Zoe rather than Mia, just because it brings in the serum Zoe? creation no, no. cutscene. It's a little quicker. Do you have both ingredients? Right here. Nikki Boozy, how you doing, Nikki? It would make him fast enough. My father and Lucas aren't far away. He's coming. Yeah, it's going good, Jim. It's going well. Good. There's enough for two. There's enough for two. Hurry it up there. So let's not free Mia. We can just leave it tied up. It's fine. And we'll just wait for Zoe to do her thing. So after we make the serum, what's next? There's a boat outside. We'll take it through the swamp. But... Now the vessel get very far without the serum. Just press X as soon as you can, or pick up the serum. Okay, hey, so third... One of those is mine. Third jack fight already. There's lots of ammo in this room. Zoe! Get your ass back to the house! I will deal with you later! So, shotgun out here. Assuming it's in the same place anyway, I don't know where it's going to be, shit, I should have looked. I think it's up, not down. Okay, 
shoot that arm, that eye if you can a couple of times. Ah, and then you want to drop down here. You could die on Jack, actually. If you hang around under here, you get a lot of free time to chill. And if he comes back down, go back up. And especially if you're going for the low heels. This is getting old, Jack. Stuff like that. You can get that eye on your left that I just had a look at at the beginning really quickly. But it ain't easy. Just go for it, whichever eyes you can see. Take your time. We got plenty of time here, so I'm not worried. Right, so is he, when he comes up, you want to go down. He hasn't come up yet, so we're good. Still looking for us like a dumbass. That eye's taking a beating. That's good. There we go. That's one eye. We've only got one bullet left for this. But if we come down here, we've got our running speed back too. Let's go and quickly... Oh, oh, I meant to get my knife out of there. Shit. Scavenger. This is big attack. Still shakes the ground you're under. So let's... Oh, shot. There we go. Look at that shit. That hurt, Jack? Looked like it did. I'll reload in here, Jack. Give me a sec. I'm busy. Shotgun shells. Like I said, there's a ton of ammo in here. He, he always seems to run away, too, so... You have plenty of time to do this. So if he's looking at you like that, run the fuck away because he's about to stomp on you. Here he comes. Ah, keep shooting those fucking eyes. Let's say that as I'm missing him. He's gonna smash. Hulk smash incoming. Shotgun out for the tail one. Uh oh, Hulk smash, Hulk smash. Get to that ladder. Yeah. I'm not sure if there's more ammo up here. There probably is. He's not happy about Marguerite dying. I also think if you run out of ammo, it just spawns more for you, because you kind of need guns for this bit. But let's go have a look in this box, see what we can get. I want to gather up as much ammo as we can. Some shotgun shells on the wall too. Oh no, he's spraying at me. Fuck, you son of a bitch. Okay, shotty shells. Oh, I don't want the first aid, I want the shells. He's down there again, so let's just keep an eye on him. Hopefully we can get our health back. Ah, actually hit one of his eyes there. I don't know how. Which one did I hit? <laughs> take your time. Take your time. I'm not rushing this because this is like the last tricky fight. For you. Okay, back down, back down. Shoot that shit. It's getting close. I think he's just gonna pop. Oh, he missed. He missed his big attack. Oh fuck! I gotta reload. That's perfect too. There we go. Again, if you look out for these boilers, there's ladders in here. Here's the ladder. Fuck, go. Go to the ladder. Go to the ladder. Play it safe. Play it safe. Ooh. Hungry. Hungry. This is the fucking hardest boss. You can do fast at least. It's easy to actually do, but it's really difficult to do fast. That eye, this front eye is really hurt, isn't it? I'm just trying to figure out what eyes he's got left now. I don't think he's got many, he's got a couple left. It's, I reckon that front one is in some pain. See you later, Jack. You ain't hitting me, mate. Oh, I should have jumped down rather than crawling like this. Just missed his attack there. Very nice. And after this point, you get all your health back again. Well, that's his face. So there's one there. Hit. Keep popping it. Got it. Not sure how many he's got left now. Probably one or two. I think the last one he's got left is the one that's underneath him. Just go up. <clears throat> Come on then, Jack. Seven anger bullets left. Might have to get shotgunny for this last one if you don't show it to me. So I think to get this one, you have to be underneath him. Ah, like this. Where is it, Jack? Show me the eye you've got left. Where is it, mate? Fuck you. Fuck you. You missed. There he is. Oh, is it in his face? Is the one in his face? Got it. Pretty sure that's all of them. Yeah. Fuck are you, Jack? 
the rest of this fight's pretty easy. Just keep your shotgun out if you've got shotgun ammo. You should have plenty left from what's been in this room. Oh no, he's got one. Fuck. Got him. The last one, I think. It's gotta be. You'll know you've done here when he pounds the ground a couple of times. Uh oh, no, he's not done. To the ladder. Ah, shit. Where's his last one then? I look, I'm lost here. Better not die. So close to dying. We've only got the shotgun left. I'm not using first aid, leave me alone. Could do, because it will still be in the parameters of the achievement, but I don't want it. I need to know where this last eye is, otherwise we're fucked. Down we go. It's on it. Ah, there it is. For fuck's sake. Sit still, Jack, damn it. Miss me, dick bag. Can't see the eye from there, Jack. It's not useful to us. <laughs> see what he does. Yeah, he's staying up there, good. Got it! We've got like 30 something shotgun shells. We'll smash this. We've got loads of ammo at the end. Go on, Jack. Pound the ground like a mean it. Good lad. So, again, keep the shotgun loaded for this next bit. So you can shoot him in the eye, you only need to shoot him in the eye twice. Can't see, there we go. Run it nice and close. This fight's pretty much done with. Scavenge the area. First aid man. Shotgun shells, we want that. Let's quickly discard the meds. Now, I've seen everything. <clears throat> right, Zoe opens this door for us. Ethan, this way. Yeah, yeah. We finished the second one yesterday in about two, hour, two hours. I think the game time was actually two hours and five minutes. But this is the new game run, which means we're not allowed any unlock rules. Trying not to heal, trying not to die, trying not to use the item box. We've done really well with this so far. It's been a good run so far. It's him done with. And that's pretty much the last tough bit. The rest of it's quite simple. Simply because we have full right? health. Yeah. Come on. Mia's waiting for us. Okay. I need to run through here then. Come on, move it. We ain't got all day, fun. Okay. Follow this round. And we have a little conversation here. I had to use one of them. There's only one left. There's only one left. So just keep your camera over to the left, left here. The hell are we gonna just keep smashing now? X and you can heal Mia as soon as possible. There we go. And it is sneaky <gasps> speed run cigarette time. It was foolish thinking I could escape. But Zoe. Go! Both of you just go! Come with us. Yeah, this is gonna I'm, I'm sure there's someone who can help. This is gonna this smash the help. previous. Uh Apparently no, I'm not the old one. Most definitely. I'll send help. Don't bother. There won't be anyone left to help! Oh, damn it. The no-heel run yesterday was two hours, 25. Ethan? Thank you. Who the hell else was I gonna choose? Ethan. Mia, I know you've been through a lot. But we need to talk. You had something to do with all this, didn't you? Um. <clears throat> Look, I just want to know the truth. Ethan, I honestly don't remember. Try. Cigarette smoked. Is that the boat? How the fuck did that get here? 
We've come far, Dords. Done well on this as well. An hour and a half to get to this point is actually a good time by itself. This could actually beat the uh, <laughs> you're okay. The run from yesterday, but how was know. that? What the fuck? What is that? What is that? Yeah, the game time, like the timer said two hours and eight, but the game time was like two hours and three. I'm guessing it doesn't count loading screens and maybe some other shit. I don't know. <clears throat> but yeah, for anyone who doesn't know, I know I keep repeating myself, but we're going for Mommy. no heals, no item boxes, um, and the speed run pretty much in one go. We can heal three times, but it's cooler if we do it without healing. Uh, hopefully no yeah. deaths, but meh, deaths happen sometimes. <laughs> That freak death we had on Evelyn yesterday on the last boss was bullshit. Well, hopefully that doesn't happen today. All right. So we're going to run straight here. We need to get to Ethan. Let's go. Oh. He's down here. Ethan. Yeah. Okay. Here he is. Ethan. Ethan. He gets taken away. We want to come through this entrance. Ethan. Ethan. And go to the left when it lets us. It's like the invisible wall lasts ages there. But oh well. Keep going. I'm gonna jump up here. Keep following the ship through. So we're gonna go through this door on the left. Let's go. So, keep following this round. Pretty straightforward here. Go, 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 go. I want to head to the right. Should get a little flashback thing now, but just keep moving. Don't pay attention to it. <clears throat> Damn it. Keep going. Keep going. Keep following the dank and... What was that? Super aids. Tanker. <laughs> Uber chlamydia walls. Fucking fantastic. Right. Keep going, looping on these stairs. And this is the last floor. I need to go in here. And quickly turn around and get to this door to get another flashback. They're dead. They're all dead. I'm trying to wait for this. Cut seat to finish so we can go through this hatch. What the fuck are you talking about? You should kill them all! Fuck. What the hell is going on? We need some weapons. Is there any weapons on this ship? I, I, I don't know. Look, let's go this way. Maybe we can get out. Let's go. Right, ducking down. Heading to the left. Avoid the sticky wall. The pipe likes to stop me there. Quite often bang my forehead on that pipe and get stuck. <laughs> Keep following this through. We want to go left here and then a hard right straight after this way. And then when we drop down here, we want to turn to the left. And yeah, this way. Keep it moving. Ignore these doors. Swing a left and a right. I'm going to go to this door at the end. Run through here to this door. Straight up these stairs for the little cutscene of Evelyn. Settle down, little girl. Settle down. Ah! Ah! Keep moving forward. Keep moving. Stop slowing me are down, Evelyn. Remembering? What? What are you? <laughs> Creepy as shit is what she is. <laughs> Go. Okay, keep running. Keep following the shit through. Up the ladders. <laughs> yeah, those guys definitely had a bad day on this ship. Okay, so then we're going left through this door. Oh, stuck on something. Dead guy stuck in the doorway. Up the ladder. And up these stairs for another little scene with Evelyn. What are you talking about? You Piss off, Evelyn. Wait. Okay. I'm tired of so, waiting. turn around as soon as she says that. Head this way. And then we want to go grab this fuse. 
Avoid the monster, of course. Spam that X button, run away. He didn't get a hit on us, which is really nice. Keep running. Slap this in here. And off we go. Straight up to the third floor. That's floor two. And one more set of stairs. Uh, there we go. Oh, is the four on a beta out? I didn't know that was out. I'm going to have a look at that. The game looks fucking awesome. Uh, oh, uh, which way do we want to go here? Oh, yeah, through here. And quickly grab the videotape. Slam it in here. Watch it. We have what? a long loading screen because we're on Why? console, but... VHS start. Again, an hour and 34. We're doing pretty well here. On the timer there. <clears throat> we might even be ahead of our New Game Plus run, which is nice, but I'd, we'll see. We will see. I know that Jack and Marguerite definitely take me quite a bit of time. <clears throat> I'd like to check the Forerunner beta out. We have another cutscene here. Alan. With Mia's side hole. As you must have infected me during the attack. And I'm too far gone anyway. <sighs> Live until the 30th. Oh. I'll go have a look at that. But it Those serves me right. It's my fault she got out. Yeah, it is. It's your fault, fault, dummy. But that doesn't mean I'm going to let you die. She didn't attack you? It's part of her imprinting protocol. I can't believe this is happening. Here, take it. It has her tissue samples. You find her. Fix this. Okie doke. Right, so. Okay, Evie. Where straight are Straight through you? here. And we're going to head left out of that door, then right around this corner. And then we're going to go through this door on our right. She's close. She's close. There we go. Crawl through this little space. Quickly press X on this for another. She's vomiting. Cool Damn. with we'll have to boy Alan. How's it going? She's vomiting. Far more in excess of her body mass. Oh, great. <laughs> We're going to be seeing a lot more of her ugly friends if this keeps up. <laughs> All right. We need to find her and fast. This is getting out of hand. Agreed. Agreed. So I'm not sure which way we want to take it, right? To get to the elevator quickest? No, not other way. Okay, so we want to take a left out of that door. Try to remember that. We've got to run all the way around. I'm pretty sure we've got to run past some douche canoes here. Yep, there's one douche canoe. I'll just avoid him for the moment, though. We might have to shoot him in a second. I'm going to come down here. Press this button. Actually, you know what? I'm going to come back and kill this guy so he doesn't get in our way. There we go. He's done. And then when this comes down... Is it coming here? We have another guy that spawns in here, so I'll quickly get rid of him. Get in there. There we go. Back up. Shoot him in the face, obviously. Go. And we're going down to S2. If you're lucky, you can just kill that one and get in the elevator and avoid the other one, but that's kind of difficult to do sometimes. Right. <clears throat> here we are. Keep running, keep running. Right, let's swing it right here. We're just running pra past pretty much everything here. Keep the knife out. There's one. Run past that prick. I don't think we've taken any hits yet, which is really good for us. Keep running here. Avoid this monster too. Just run past him. <clears throat> Some bombs there we need to gr grab on the way back. But we'll save that for then. Again, just keep running past everything. Fuck everything in this area. There's only a couple of enemies we actually need to kill. Run past this guy. If you're a little bit worried, you can always get your guard up. But don't check. Oh no, we're not there yet. Okay, keep following these stairs. Swing the right. When you get here, don't check that door. Just head straight down, because you skip a cutscene with Alan or a little phone call with him. Just come to here. Crack this open. Grab yourself some corrosive. Quickly. Thank you. And then we're going to head back through this door. Just open it up with the corrosive. Let's 
just go. So then we... Are you mad at me, Mommy? No, Evie. I I'm not mad. Just run around the a circle in this sort of little what square area. Me? I don't want to live in the Head lab back anymore. To the door. I want a house. And I want you to be my mommy. Okay, Evie. <laughs> I'll be your mommy. Just, just come... Evie, wait! Let's go. We have another phone call with Alan, which we have to sit through. Did you find her? Just keep walking yes, towards but she the ran off. came from. She's making more friends, Alan. Those things are everywhere. I told you so. <coughs> are you okay? <laughs> you just worry about getting Evelyn back. Okay, let's go. Bust through this door like a bus. Come on. And off we go. We'll need the gun here to kill one of these guys. One of them is crawling and one of them's walking. You might need to kill the one and shoot the other back. Blast that bitch, you guys. Stun that bitch and try and run past. There we go. We need to grab these bombs on the left. And just to make it a little bit easier for us, I'm going to open up this. And grab the bombs and the corrosive that are in here. We don't need the corrosive, but grab the bombs. Get going. And now we want to use the bombs for this next bit because we get sort of trapped. So we're going to push down. Slap this down here, take that guy out. Should have him killed, that's another two. Put that down, detonate. Should be good to run. Lovely. Pretty sure you can stand really close to the bombs and it doesn't hurt you, but just for safety's sake, we'll run away. Press that button, chill here for a sec. For the elevator to come down, I don't think we've got anything coming, nope. <clears throat> just wait here. Well, I think something's coming along. I hear something, but we're alright. Got this. In we go, come on, invisible walls. And to floor three. <clears throat> now we need to return to the VHS room. Emergency safety lockdown system has been engaged. Bang this open. <clears throat> Jump up. I think we want to go to our left now. Oh no, it's right. Sorry. Or is it? I don't remember shit. I don't remember. Oh yeah, we want to go in here. See, oh no, we didn't. Ah, oh, fuck, we fucked that up last time. Yeah, we didn't get the cutscene good. So don't go there. Go left, straight out of there. Don't go into that room, because you get another little stupid cutscene. You don't need. Just go straight through here. And then swing it round. Come through here. This guy we've got to run past. I'm pretty sure, yep. Oh, we got me, son of a bitch. So, through here. And there's some more machine gun bullets if you do want them. Just here, I'm going to grab them just... For safety's sake, if we need him. Oh shit, I missed him. Fuck it, let's go. Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Who cares? I don't care enough. Yeah. Go, go, go. Bust open this door. We want to run all the way up to the third floor. Through here. Keep following this round. And through here. The super gonorrhea man. How did you get here? Where's Evie? She's out of control. Without the treatments, she's deteriorating. Well, it's a good thing we're already dying. <coughs> Don't say that. She trusts you. That little bitch, she never trusts. Okay, wait. Evie, no, Evie, Evie. Evie. Ellen, listen. I didn't mean to call you that. She's Bye, trying to mean, take control. Mean, you have to fight her. Bye, mate. Evelyn, stop! Stop right now! Don't touch me, don't! Didn't go well, buddy. Didn't go well at all. <clears throat> right now that that's done, just want to run through the door ahead of us. I'm covered in gonorrhea now. Yeah. That reaction, though. Let's go. Straight through the storm, limping now. We're all nice and slow. Yeah. Yeah. We've been here a lot recently. Yeah. Yeah. We just want to go straight through this door. Swing a left. 
This guy's running away from the Super 8s. Oh, he got him. We'll be together forever. <laughs> okay, so we can actually skip this cutscene when it comes in. There we go. It's like one of the few we can actually skip. And that's the VHS done. And now we've got a little bit more of this area before we get back to Ethan. Well, these loading screens are real on the PlayStation. <clears throat> Come on, <laughs> Jesus, watching that little cassette tape thing roll in the corners annoying and then it usually turns into like this massive bar yeah there we go <laughs> literally on the PC these loading screens are like 10-15 seconds I don't know if you had like because I know you can get replacement hard drives for your Playstation and your Xbox like you can put in pretty much any one you want right so I don't know if you do that like if the loading times are like way faster oh, man, look at this like, really? It's easily a minute or something we've sat here for. I think this is the longest one, and the one into the VHS, VHS tape, that's the longest yeah, loading screen, I think. I remember. Yes, Evelyn. I we remember. remember. Can we be a family like before? No. No, Evie. We can't be a family. We were never a family. We will never be a family. Need you anymore. <laughs> Get on my face, Evie. Right, so we're going this way. And we're going to crank open the elevator here. And then we're going to go straight up the ladder. Yeah. So, you know, I don't think we need to grab those remote bombs for Ethan from there. I'm not sure. But I know where we can get one, really. We only need one, to be fair. I'm getting texted. And we can get that right here. So make sure you don't miss this because it makes a, li a little bit later in the game one part, the very end, pretty much, very close to the end, much, much easier. So you want to grab Ethan's remote bomb, which is on this computer over here. It's nice and worked into the run as well. It's right there. So and then we're going to go this way and head through the captain's cabin and grab the wrench. The map is also there if you want it. We don't want that shit. We're just going to keep going. I'm going to go back to the elevator. Crank that open. Then we're going to open up the hatch. What the fuck? Took me out of that without me pressing anything. Okay, so once we're in here, we need to go... There's two floors, I think, we need to go to. We need to go to the second floor, first of all, and we need to head right. Survival knife there, even though we're not going to use any weapons for this. We need to head right here and into this door. Ignore that guy. Grab up the corrosive that's on the floor. Open that up again. So, and then we want to go to the first floor, I believe. Which is down. We want to go right again. There's a liquor down here, so be careful, but don't worry about it too much. Because you're uneasy, you can take quite a bit of damage. Just keep running to your right. I'm going to go grab that fuse out of the door that we put in there earlier. This liquor never seems to be facing you. Let's first get to this area. Grab that and go. Try your best to avoid the liquor. Keep running. Back to the elevator. That's literally all we need from down here. So, up we go. And we're going to go up the ladder in the elevator so we're on top of it and go to the third floor. Up we go. <clears throat> so once you've got the elevator open, you pretty much have access to all floors. That's the way you want to look at it. So into the third floor. Go on, up you go. Is it, uh, it's right we want to head, I think. Yeah. No, 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 no. It's, le yeah, it's left out of there this way. And then use that one corrosive we got for the room where Alan was on this door to go and get the power cable. Don't worry about that guy. Just get to using your corrosive. Pretty sure once you're using the corrosive, 
can't bug you, so run through here. There's also a fat boy that spawns in this area. And you just want to grab the power cable and run past him. We've got good health here, so I'm not worried about taking too much damage. But after this, we've just got to get down to the basement again. And then we're done with this area for Mia, which is good. It's a good time. Let's grab this stuff. And... Come on, this one. Sort of get a second in between whilst these are unraveled and it's kind of annoying. Grab the power cable. Come on. There we go. Run away from the fat man that's here. Just run. Just run. Just run. A lot of the time he doesn't even make it around the corner, but yeah, we made it. And that guy that was crawling is also still here when you come back to this bit, so just be wary of him too. There we go. Just run past him. Keep going. You don't have to close the door, don't worry. Back to the elevator. And then we're going to drop down into it, put the stuff in, and then we're off the uh, S2. We've got a little run to do downstairs that can be a tad tricky, but we'll be fine. I'm feeling it. Right, they're both in, and the elevator should power up. Get ready to press S2. Spam that button. Spam it. There we go. <laughs> Come on. Right. A little bit of a run again here. He's waiting. Fuck you. I don't think... I'm pretty sure we don't have to fight anything down here, though. We just keep running. Got my gun at the ready. Well, no. I've got no gun at the ready <laughs> to shoot these guys. Run past that one. See you later, mate. We're running. There's a liquor here. Avoid that prick. Let's go to the left, then round on the right. Oh, he hit us. It's okay. Keep running. We've still got full running speed. Didn't even take us to blood splatter, so we're fine. A guy spawns on these stairs that you want to run into a little bit to push him back, and then you can just run past him. And then we've got a fat boy here, which needs to run around. He can be a bit tricky at times. There's a first aid in that crate if you want it. Keep running. Keep running. Fuck those guys. Keep going. And then we're going to go through this door. I need to do something. <laughs> Ethan... Have a good time, Milka. He's got his prom tonight or something. Ethan. Have a good night. Hope it's memorable. <laughs> Ethan. So we can't skip this cutscene either with Jack? Hey, shh. I know, I know, I know. I'm not going to hurt you. Hell, I never would have if I could have helped you. What do you mean? <clears throat> I'm no killer, son. Neither is Marguerite, nor my boy Lucas. Or even Zoe here. That girl, Evelyn. She did this. What the hell is she? Now, what did she do to you? She infected us with her gift. That's what she calls it. I found her near a busted out tank in the bayou. Everything changed after that. So she infects you, and then she takes control? No. Not exactly, son. She just... She forces her way into your mind, your soul. You can't fight back. You are connected to her, and you can't resist the urge to... You're a different person after that. Just like Mia. So Mia sent me that message because of Evelyn. Listen, the, the girl just wants a family of her own. She's the key, all right? You find her and you stop her. Ethan. I think I know what Jim's talking about. Free Everyone's family. showing up in limos and shit. Please. <clears throat> right, so. Evelyn, Dave, Another little cutscene here. Hi. Kind of annoying that we get stuck it behind this black him. mess for a minute. I can make him love you. Don't. Don't hurt him. <laughs> Silly, I told you I'm not gonna hurt him. Don't you dare. For what? <laughs> You're not my mommy. Remember? Come on. 
Seen 22 yet, Ashley. I need to watch that. Okay, so turning around here, running away, and heading straight okay, to this door. Bitch. We're gonna go the to the right in here around the ship through this little hole in the gate. Oh, come on, get going. Swing it right when we get through this next door, running through the dead fishy swamp. Yes. <sighs> we have our last box use coming up, so we need to make sure you grab everything you need for this last run of the game. But I think we're going to be fine because we've got a lot of shotgun ammo and that's all we really need. Um, we have to deal with Evelyn at the end. Hopefully she doesn't mysteriously kill me. Sometimes she just has a habit of killing me, even though I put tons of damage into her, which is annoying as fuck. But oh well. I need to remember to bring my remote bomb this time. Last time I'm pretty sure we forgot to bring it. Left it in the box. Because Mia's things are now in this box, which is great. So if you grab that remote bomb as Mia... You get one here. I'm pretty sure there's some lying around somewhere as Ethan, though. You can get some. Just unsure on where. <laughs> there's also a ton of ammo before you go into this last bit. But we've got a little bit more to do anyway. Let's jump up here. And we want to swing it to our right to grab the next bag upgrade, which is right in front of us. Right there. And then we're going to go to the box. Again, just take a minute. Grenade launcher. Taking that. Take a minute to make sure you've got everything you need. We've taken me as things. So stuff we don't want. Any of that. Don't want any of that. Uh, the crow key can stay. G17 handgun, we need that one. We need the knife, we need the shotgun, the shotgun shells. We don't need the crank, we need the flame rounds. The remote bomb, we don't need the survival knife. I think that's everything. Yep, let's go through this door to the left. And right here you have a bunch of douche canoes hanging around. Uh, but if you quit, you don't have to fight any of them. We're just going to run past this dude, swing it right past this guy, and then quickly press this button. And then we're going to hang around on the door, just run into it, run into it, run towards that switch. Press the button as fast as you can, and you shouldn't have to find any of these dudes. We're going through this way, so we want to close this door. <clears throat> okay. So we're at the final stretch. Let's go. Just keep the shotgun at the ready. We've got plenty of bullets. I can't run. Come on, let me go. There we go. Let's get ready to shoot this liquor that drops down in the face, even though we don't have to. I'm going to. That's where I get chunked. Duck under these. Again, you can destroy them if you want, but I'm just going to duck under them all. A few of them around. That's three. I think there's one here too. Yep. There we go. Just run past these guys. Stick to the left. Stick to the left. Stick to the left. Keep running. Drop down here. And we're going to go up to the right. Oh, and then left through here. And we're going to run straight up to the top of here and push this minecart down. There we go. No. I got that bolted on the way down. Okay, keep running. Forget everything that's behind you. Just keep going. Keep going towards this ship, and we want the, we're going to have to use the shotgun for this because I don't have any pistol bullets. Keep running. Ignore that box because it explodes, and then we're going to go through here to the right, through this door, to the left, and we're going to open this up. Put the tissue samples in here. <clears throat> here we go. Grab up those of the neurotoxin. Watch that fetus get drained. That's pretty gross. Oh, I don't want to look at that. Just give me the neurotoxin. Thank you. Okay, let's go. This is the way. Let's do this. Go left. Swing your left around this corner as well. 
straight down here. And this is the bit you kind of need the shotgun for. So if you don't have any shotgun ammo, you might struggle. But um, whatever weapons you've got, you only need to take out a couple of guys. So don't sweat it too much. Most of it you can just run through. And then you've got those two fat guys to deal with at the end, but that's why we have the remote farm. I do have it, I do. Lovely. Let's go. So, straight up here, around that guy that spawns in. Watch out for the sticky hill that always tends to stop me. Run past this guy. Keep going. Keep running. I don't think he has any arms, so pretty much all he can do is bite and headbutt you. <laughs> Keep running. Keep running. I'm gonna shotgun this guy in the face just because I can. There's one more ahead of us we need to shotgun as well. Spawns in here. Make sure you hit him in the face. There we go, he's still alive. There we go. Keep running. There is stuff behind you right now. And we have a liquor that jumps out in front of us in a second that we need to pop the face off of. Which is fine. There we go, no face, Mr. Liquor. Keep running. Run past this guy, fuck him. Oh, he hit us. Yeah, usually those two spawn together, so I'll be ready for those guys. Those last two monsters a lot of the time spawn together. But let's quickly put the remote palm on. Grab that shit. So we're going to run straight to the back here, to behind this little construction thing. Drop this down, blow these dickheads up, go straight up the ladder. Go, 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 go. If you want to be a little more time effective there, you can wait till you're at the ladder to detonate, but I think we've got it sorted. And that's pretty much the last butt clenchy bit. We've just got to do um, Evelyn now. So let's go through here. This is going to be a good new game time. I'm hoping. Okay, so just want to check what's in here. We have any pistol bullets? Machine gun ammo? No, okay. No good to me. There's some machine gun bullets there if you want them, but we know how machine gun. We didn't go and get that from here, so we don't have it. And it's back where we where it all began. Sure Wait right here for this cutscene to finish. It's not here. It's gone. It's gone. <clears throat> there we go. Okay, through the left to the right. And then we've got a couple of scenes to watch here. Back at the beginning. I'm gonna run through the hallway. <laughs> Observe you getting thrown through the wall. <laughs> run. Fuck you, Evelyn. We should have a little cutscene here. Your fault. What? Ethan, it's okay. It's okay, it's me. I know you didn't mean to hurt me. Kill him, mommy. Oh, but you shouldn't have done that! Fuck you, Mia. It fucking hurts! He doesn't want to be my daddy? Then he can die. Yeah, fuck you. Okay, so... Now it's mommy's turn to kill you! Let's get moving. We need to run to the left here, around all of this shit, uh, through the kitchen. We get another little cutscene with Evie. <laughs> You're gonna be one of us. And then maybe you'll play nice. No! I'm not playing. No! Get that away from me! I run away because Mia spawns there. Got that doll right there, but fuck that. Keep going. We're gonna go upstairs now. And another me should spawn in this corner. We're just gonna try and run past up. Bitch, get away from me. Alright, that's that sorted. And then we've got a little battle with Evie here. You need to use your L1 to guard. Come on, give me the fast one. Right, now we run. Run, 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 run. Wait for it to curl up into a little ball. Okay, we should have her now. No! No, no, no! Suck it, suck it, suck it. <laughs> you. Why does everyone hate me? Because you suck. <laughs> So I'm going to use my grenade launcher on her this time. Hopefully that does the trick. And then shotgun. She don't like it. But if you're struggling for ammo here... Give me control, please. Give me control. Give me control. 
with some ammo here in the corner if you need it. Right, grenade launcher time. I'm in. I want to stick to the back right corner because that seemed to do me a solid yesterday. Keep aiming for them eyes. The manually reload this thing. I think I'm going to hit her with the enhanced handgun now. I'm going to go after this. I'm going to take the shotgun. The other one is for us, so why not? Get back, Eevee. Oh, there we go, we got it. Sweet. We might actually, yeah, well, I think we're going to beat our new game plus time here. This part of the game is pretty straightforward. I haven't got my handgun on? Shit, okay. Shotgun it is. That's all we have. Wish I had the handgun. I should have really managed that. Little boy. Reloading. Come and spike me in the leg, will ya? Come on. Get your fucking spork hand down here. Reloading it, then, you mind? For the loss. Uh, oh, here we go. Uh, ah. Ah, I just wanted a family. No family for you, Evie. Oh, I've got to reload, Evie. Give me a sec. I'm not sure if you want to shoot a hand here. little bit here. I'm almost done, ladies. Oh, I'm getting ah. shanked. Use it. Use I'm it. using it. Give me. Yeah. 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 Let me go. It takes the speed one. Play time, bro. Bad TV. Stank bitch. Do it. Count the time until we uh, get off this little bit. I think we pretty much the time should have started by now, but we'll wait. We'll wait until this cutscene ends. We can skip everything else. <laughs> so yeah, we've, I think we've beat our new game plus time, which is awesome. Pretty sure I can go back and beat that with the walking shoes and stuff like that. Okay, bam. Two hours and six. Yesterday it was two hours and eight. But that the game time the game time will probably be different. Let's check. Let's have a little look. See here. So you won't see my achievements popping up because I've already got them. But hopefully this has helped some of you on YouTube out. Two hours and three. Damn, that was fast. That was fast. I'm happy with that. Is that faster than the? Well, that was the new game plus time. That's new game. So that's a good like twenty minutes off the world record that's up at the moment. I don't know. We'll have a quick. Let's have a quick check. See if the world record's changed. I did submit a couple of my runs yesterday. Um, but we'll see what happens. Ah. Let's check the leaderboard. You want console? No, I haven't been put on there yet. I'm guessing they have to review them and stuff, but also there's going to be a ton of people like you know, submitting new times, but the top time on speedrun.com for console, new game is 2 hours and 27 minutes. We smashed that yesterday, but I've just beat it again now. But yeah, if you're watching this on YouTube, thank you all so much for watching. I really appreciate that. Much love. And until next time, take it easy.